Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to be doing a quick who's coming towards you all signs reading. Okay, so this isn't a channeled reading. This is a bit different. Um, I will say though, if I do get some channeled messages when I'm pulling cards, I will say them. Um, but this is just a quick who's coming towards you all signs reading. So this is a general reading. So for the collective, okay, so let's see who's coming towards you. Okay, Knight of Wands. So it could be a fire sign. All right. Let's see who's coming towards you. Okay. Okay, so who's coming towards you? This could definitely be a lot of air here. We have the Seven of Swords, Five of Swords, Five of Pentacles, Six of Cups. So I feel like who's coming towards you could be someone, y'all, I don't like this, you know, that past energy could be someone from your past, okay? Could be a friend, could be a lover, could be a family member. The Seven of Swords here, so this makes you feel like this person could be someone who maybe did some deceptive things to you, could have betrayed you, could have played some mind games here, Five of Pentacles here. Um, I definitely feel like who, has, who this person's coming towards you is someone who could be strategizing they're planning, they're plotting how to come towards you here, okay? I'm getting a lot of strong Pisces energy. This person could be a Pisces. Something could have happened during Pisces season. I'm also getting something about October. Something could have happened in October between you and this person. I'm also getting October 15th. Someone could have a birthday October 15th. I'm getting a lot of Scorpio energy as well here. <clears throat> this person here... Five of Pentacles, Six of Cups. I definitely feel like this is somebody who caused you a lot of games, like caused you a lot of headaches, okay? They caused a lot of games for you. I feel like this could be someone who could also now be experiencing headaches for the pain that they caused you, okay? I feel like this person could even suffer from some migraines or this person caused you a headache, okay? This person could wear a lot of hoodies, Okay, this person could wear a lot of hoodies, gray hoodies, so they like to wear a lot of baggy clothes, okay? Or this person could be from the hood, I just heard. Or this person could like leather, black leather clothing. This person could be a sharp dresser, or this person could be someone also who may like to do things at night. This could be a night owl, this person, or this person may kind of, it's kind of like a shady energy I'm picking up on, okay? I'm getting this person may like to wear a lot of hoodies, all right? Hoodies and black pants. Five of Pentacles. This is someone that made you feel left out. I feel like this person could also be left out. This person could also be going struggling financially. I'm getting this person could also be facing some type of an eviction or this person just feels very guilty for how they treated you. It's almost like they're alone now. And they could be isolating themselves too or this is how they made you feel, okay? The number five is coming in strongly. I'm hearing the initials DJ. I'm also hearing the initials L, P, L, J, D, L. For some of you, this is may will not resonate. For some of you, this person, if you were suspecting if this person had like issues with their sexuality, you were right. This person could have been on, on the down low or they could have been doing something in secret, doing something in silence here, okay? But now this person feels guilty. Definitely someone from your past, maybe you had kids with this person, okay? Could have been also a childhood friend, a family member. Someone could also have a golden retriever or a dog, okay? Maybe this person acted like a dog. Or this person was moving like an animal. Um, I also get that for some of you, too, like a dog is very significant. I don't know why a dog is coming in strongly. Some of you may have a dog that you're very connected to, okay? So let's see. I don't know how the animal and the dog ties into this person. This person may have even tried to do something to your animal. I don't know I'm getting that. I don't know if they try to steal or take something from your animal or they try to take your animal or something about a dog too here is very significant. It may not, this is a very specific message for someone here. Maybe this person also, if you live with this person, they could have also mistreated your animal or mistreated your dog or your cat or your child here. Something that was very dear to you, okay? You trusted this person and they hurt you. 
or this person was you were very connected to this person and they betrayed you but i don't know why i'm getting something about an animal in specific again don't take it if it doesn't resonate but i don't know why i got that okay what is their intentions the ace of swords the eight of cups in reverse okay so this person they want to come in and tell you the truth Ace of Swords, Eight of Cups, Reverse. They want to come back and make maybe come to you with some truth or some clarity. I almost feel like for some of you, you didn't get the full truth of this person. Or it's almost like I'm hearing unsent or unsaid. Maybe someone blocked someone or there was some type of miscommunication. I also feel like some of you guys already know the truth about this person. Someone could have a nose ring, okay? I'm also getting a specific energy for some of you. Because I just heard Lilith. I saw the horns and I saw Lilith. Some of you could work with Lilith, okay, or work with Ravens. Someone's middle name can be Raven or their first name. I feel like for some of you, if you did like a spell or you did a true spell to get this person to reveal their true colors or get them to communicate with you to come back, it's working. That's for a very specific few of you. I don't know why I'm getting that that uh, magic energy here. Not all of you. But for some of you, you already know the truth. You have... You, some of you could have a telepathic connection to this person or you can feel they're coming back like you can be getting signs or it's like you can hear their thoughts some of you have the gift of telepathy okay telepathic telepathic i'm sorry i can't say that word some of you guys can read people's minds or you can read this person's mind i feel like you already know the truth about this person it's almost like this is going to be confirmation for when this person comes in but this person wants to give you some truth but it's almost like you already know the truth about this person all right, what is the most likely outcome? The Eight of Pentacles reversed. The Five of Wands reversed. So I definitely feel like there was going to be some type of communication here. Um, but I almost feel like this energy of you guys maybe not wanting to work on this anymore, you guys not wanting conflict. I kind of don't feel like this person is going to come back wanting to start any drama. I don't feel that, but I almost feel like you're done with the drama. Maybe this person could have had you in a competition, could have had you with someone. You could have a child with this person. You could have a fire sign daughter with this person or a fire sign child. I feel like, though, you're done with the games. You're done with this immaturity. You don't want to fight anymore. I also feel like for some of you, you're like, you don't feel, for some of you, it's like, you're not even really that bothered by this person. Like, you're moving forward. You're moving towards your desires. I'm hearing you feel very light, light as a feather. Okay, sting like a bee. I don't know why that came in very strong. But I feel like for some of you, the most likely outcome is you're not going to want to work on it with this person because this person could have um, been very, like, combative or this person had you in this energy of drama. You're done with the drama or... I, I, you don't want to even work on this with this person here. This person could have also had five different personalities. I'm hearing multiple personality disorder or five different something, five something, five something's coming out very strong, okay? But I feel like you're done with this person. I don't feel like you really want to invest in this person anymore because you don't want this page energy here. But I also feel like you're moving forward towards your passion, toward your towards your creativity. Let me pull one more card for, yeah, the Nine of Pentacles. I feel like you're no longer wanting to invest in this and you are more focused on being single, more focused on your stability, okay? For some of you too, this person could have been very dependent on you financially, like they could have depended on you. Maybe you were the one that was working and this person was the one that was just not really working. For some of you, this person could have had a shady, did something shady on the side with their job, okay? And you got tired of the lies, you got tired of the deception. But I also feel like this person could have been codependent on you emotionally or financially and you're breaking that, you're breaking that cycle, you're breaking that tie, okay? The initials A are coming in very strong, A-S. Okay, so give me one more for the collective. What is their advice? What is their advice? Six of Pentacles reverse. Don't give to this situation, okay? Don't, don't, don't pour into this situation. Protect your energy, okay? Because justice will be served, all right? You are protected, okay? This person could be going through some legal issues as well. Maybe this could even be someone that struggled financially and maybe they want to come towards you needing some assistance. But I feel like their angels are saying, don't help this person. Don't give this person a handout. Maybe this person is used to getting what they want. This person is used to getting 
um, what they want. Okay, this person could be an only child. Okay, this person could also live in Atlanta. I heard Atlanta, Georgia, or the ATL. This person could have the initials ATL. I also got Chicago. Someone's middle name could be Chicago, or this person could live in Chicago, or this you could be from Chicago here. I'm also picking up a New York accent. Someone could have a New York accent. But I feel like you are being protected. You are being guided. And I feel like don't give to this situation. Let this person receive justice. So that is your quick reading. I hope this resonated with you guys. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.